Welcome to the World Plus U, the latest news from around the world. Imagine a whisper that has traveled for over 24 billion kilometers, a signal so faint that it is almost lost in the cosmic static, yet still it reaches us, crossing the vast, cold emptiness of interstellar space. This is not just any whisper, it is the last breath of a machine that has journeyed farther than any other human creation. That whisper carries the final echoes of Voyager 1, a spacecraft painstakingly assembled by human hands, each component crafted with care and hope. Every bolt, every circuit, every line of code was a testament to our desire to reach beyond the boundaries of our world. This is the story of Voyager 1, a story of ambition, ingenuity, and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. It is a story that began decades ago, but whose echoes will linger for centuries. Its final faint signal is more than just a stream of data. It is a message from the edge of the unknown, a statement about humanity's reach and our insatiable curiosity. Each bit of information is a thread connecting us to the farthest reaches of the cosmos. The end of its transmission marks a new chapter, one defined not by the data we receive, but by the profound silence that follows. A silence that speaks volumes about the scale of our universe and the limits of our technology. Launched in 1977, Voyager 1 and its twin Voyager 2 were designed to explore Jupiter and Saturn to send back images and data from worlds we had only glimpsed through telescopes. Their mission was bold, their goals ambitious. Anything beyond that was considered a bonus, yet these probes exceeded every expectation. They became pioneers, venturing into the unknown, sending back discoveries that rewrote textbooks and inspired generations. They sent back invaluable information from the outer planets and the very edge of our solar system, images of swirling storms on Jupiter, the rings of Saturn, and the mysterious boundaries where our sun's influence fades. The final signal from Voyager 1 is the culmination of this epic odyssey, a last report from our most distant robotic emissary, a final handshake across the void before the darkness closes in. The 1970s were a time of great ambition in space exploration, an era when humanity dared to dream bigger than ever before. The world watched as we reached for the stars, united by a sense of wonder and possibility. The Voyager missions were born from this spirit. They were built to last, equipped with instruments to revolutionize planetary science and carrying a golden record, a message to any who might one day find them, telling the story of Earth. Their journey was made possible by a rare alignment of the outer planets, a once in 176 years opportunity that allowed Voyager to slingshot from one world to the next, a cosmic game of celestial billiards that propelled them farther than anyone thought possible. The final transmission is not a message of failure, but of ultimate success. It is the closing note of a symphony that played out across the solar system, a testament to what can be achieved when we dare to explore. It marks the end of an operational lifetime that stretched far beyond its designer's dreams. Decades of discovery, of challenges overcome, of mysteries revealed. Its power source has finally faded, and the silence that follows is a testament to the immense distances and timescales of cosmic exploration. The spacecraft drifts on, silent but not forgotten, a tiny ambassador in the vastness. This last whisper reminds us of our brief, brilliant foray into the interstellar void. It is a reminder that for a moment we reached out and touched the stars. It forces us to confront our limitations while celebrating our audacity, the courage to send a fragile machine into the unknown, knowing it would one day fall silent. Voyager's silence is a powerful reminder of what we have achieved, and an invitation to dream of what we might accomplish next. Its journey may be over, but its legacy will echo through the ages, inspiring all who look up and wonder. The Voyager missions were possible thanks to a rare planetary alignment in the late 1970s. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune lined up, enabling a grand tour using gravity assists. This technique let the spacecraft slingshot from planet to planet, saving fuel and time. Voyager 2 launched first, set to visit all four giants. Voyager 1 followed on a faster path past Jupiter and Saturn. The launch window was brief, a fleeting cosmic opportunity. Gravity assists used the planet's energy to propel the probes deeper into space, a triumph of mathematics and navigation. Both voyagers hit their marks with pinpoint accuracy, a testament to the mission team's skill. Humanity seized this rare chance forever changing our view of the solar system. Voyager 1's encounters with Jupiter and Saturn marked a turning point in our exploration of the solar system. These flybys were not just milestones in space travel, 
they fundamentally changed what we knew about the giant planets and their moons. At Jupiter, Voyager 1 sent back breathtaking images and data, revealing the Great Red Spot as a massive, swirling storm system, larger than Earth itself, that had been raging for centuries. The spacecraft's close-up views allowed scientists to study the storm's complex structure and dynamic atmosphere in unprecedented detail. Even more astonishing was the discovery of active volcanoes on Io, one of Jupiter's moons. This was the first time active volcanism had been observed anywhere other than Earth, showing that Io was the most geologically active body in the solar system. Voyager also found strong evidence for a possible ocean hidden beneath Europa's icy shell, hinting at the potential for life in places previously thought impossible. These groundbreaking findings transformed our understanding of the outer solar system, revealing it as a place of intense activity and surprising diversity. When Voyager reached Saturn, it unveiled the planet's intricate and beautiful ring system in stunning detail, showing countless thin, complex rings and mysterious gaps that puzzled scientists. The spacecraft also studied Titan, Saturn's largest moon, and discovered its thick, nitrogen-rich atmosphere, denser than Earth's, and a world shrouded in orange haze, raising questions about its chemistry and the possibility of prebiotic conditions. The data from these encounters forced scientists to rewrite textbooks, revealing the outer solar system as a dynamic, ever-changing region filled with unexpected wonders. After its historic visit to Saturn, Voyager 1's path sent it out of the solar system, venturing into interstellar space, while Voyager 2 continued the grand tour, heading toward Uranus and Neptune to unlock even more secrets. The discoveries of volcanic Io, Europa's hidden ocean, and Titan's thick atmosphere expanded our search for life beyond Earth, inspiring new missions and fueling our curiosity about the possibilities of life elsewhere in the cosmos. Voyager 1's mission at Jupiter and Saturn was a spectacular success, celebrated by scientists and space enthusiasts around the world for its profound impact on planetary science. Its journey into the unknown continues, carrying humanity's message and curiosity far beyond the boundaries of our solar system. While Voyager 1 left for interstellar space, Voyager 2 explored Uranus and Neptune, at Uranus it discovered new moons, rings, and a tilted offset magnetic field. The planet's bland atmosphere contrasted with Jupiter and Saturn, hinting at a less active interior. At Neptune, Voyager 2 found the great dark spot, supersonic winds, and more moons, including Triton, with geysers and a retrograde orbit. These encounters revealed unexpected energy and activity in the distant solar system. Voyager 2's flybys provided our first close-up look at these ice giants. The grand tour ended with a wealth of new data and a new perspective on the outer planets. The mission redefined our understanding of the solar system's edge. In 1990 Voyager 1 turned its camera back toward Earth, capturing the iconic pale blue dot image. From 6 billion kilometers away, Earth appeared as a single pixel, a fragile outpost in the vast cosmos. The image's value is philosophical, reminding us of our smallness and unity. Carl Sagan's words, that's here, that's home, that's us, echo the image's message. The pale blue dot urges humility and the need to cherish our only home. After this photo, Voyager's cameras were shut down forever to conserve power. The image became one of the mission's most enduring legacies. It was Voyager's farewell glance at its creators. The pale blue dot is a timeless reminder of our place in the universe. It changed how we see ourselves. After passing the outermost planets of our solar system, Voyager 1 continued its epic journey outward, venturing into the vast and mysterious frontier known as interstellar space. The probe approached the heliopause, the invisible boundary where the solar wind from our sun is finally overpowered by the winds of the galaxy itself. This is the very edge of the sun's influence, a frontier that marks the end of our solar neighborhood and the beginning of the wider Milky Way. Scientists at NASA watched anxiously, monitoring Voyager's instruments for crucial signs, a sudden drop in solar particles and a simultaneous rise in cosmic rays from deep space. These changes would be the unmistakable indicators that Voyager had crossed into a new realm, leaving the sun's protective bubble behind. In August 2012, after decades of travel, Voyager 1's data finally confirmed what scientists had hoped for. It had entered interstellar space, now floating 122 times farther from the Sun than Earth, at a distance so great that radio signals take over 17 hours to reach us. This moment marked humanity's first direct entry into the galaxy beyond our solar system, a historic leap into the unknown, and a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity. 
for the first time, Voyager 1 began sending back direct measurements of the interstellar medium, the thin, mysterious mix of gas, dust, and magnetic fields that fills the space between the stars. Its instruments revealed new details about the density, temperature, and magnetic field strength of this uncharted environment. Voyager 1 became our first interstellar sentinel, a lone explorer reporting from the galactic wilderness, far beyond the reach of any other human-made object. Its signals, faint but persistent, continue to tell us stories from a place no one has ever seen. Its crossing of the heliopause was both a technical triumph and a powerful symbol, a reminder of how far human ingenuity can reach, and how our desire to explore knows no bounds. With Voyager's achievement, we had become a species that travels among the stars, sending our robotic emissaries into the vastness of the galaxy, carrying our hopes and questions with them. And so, the journey continues. Voyager 1 presses onward, expanding our understanding of the galaxy and reminding us that the spirit of exploration is truly limitless. Both Voyagers carry the Golden Record, a message for any extraterrestrial civilization that might find them. The record contains images, sounds, greetings in 55 languages, and music from around the world. Its cover includes diagrams showing how to play it, and a map to our solar system. The Golden Record is a cosmic time capsule, a statement of hope and curiosity. It distills the essence of humanity into a single artifact. Long after Voyager's signal fades, the record will journey on, a silent ambassador from Earth. It's a powerful symbol of our desire to connect with the universe. Voyager 1's final signal is a slow fade, not an abrupt end. As its power dwindled, engineers shut down instruments one by one. The last transmission is the spacecraft's final heartbeat, a stream of data from the edge of interstellar space. This last whisper provides one final measurement of the galaxy beyond our sun. The silence that follows marks the physical limit of our reach. For nearly 50 years, Voyager extended our senses into the unknown. Its end forces us to confront the vastness of space and the challenges of interstellar exploration. Yet the mission's legacy is not just in data, but in inspiration. Voyager will travel the Milky Way for millions of years, a silent ambassador from Earth. Its journey is far from over. Voyager 1's journey is more than a story about a machine. It's a story about humanity's drive to explore. Its discoveries at Jupiter, Saturn, and beyond reshaped our view of the solar system. The final signal is a powerful bookend to an era of exploration. The pale blue dot gave us perspective. The golden record carries our hope. Voyager's findings are milestones in our collective journey of discovery. As Voyager falls silent, we're left with both accomplishment and humility. Its legacy is a cosmic echo, a challenge for future generations to explore further. What will be our next whisper to the cosmos?